This presentation will present a course overview of NR5021. There is a big need for applied statistics classes for agriculture and natural resources graduate students. And that was really the motivation for creating this course six years ago. There are a lot of courses at the University of Minnesota on statistics, but there really wasn't one that focused on statistics for natural resources and agriculture students. And so that's really the history of this course. We'll cover the theory and the application of statistical methods uh, with a lot of example data sets from agriculture and natural resources. Many of the data sets that I use come from my own research. Uh, they come from research from my colleagues and other uh, data sets that will help us to learn um, statistics with some organisms that we're familiar with uh, from farming, from agriculture, from natural resources and the environment. There's really no prerequisite for this course. Likely you've probably had some quantitative classes in the past as an undergraduate, maybe a statistics class in the past. If you take this course, it will set you up well for other courses in statistics across the university. Many of those courses might be offered within CFANS, the College of Food, Agriculture, and Natural Resource Sciences. There are also other courses a tremendous amount of courses offered in other university departments. For example, we have a statistics department, we have a biostatistics department, we have other departments that are, have great quantitative classes like the educational psychology department. And so there are a lot of options as a graduate student for you to enroll in other classes, particularly after taking this class, that can serve as a good foundation for some of those other courses. We're going to use this book, uh, Statistics and Natural Resources Applications with R. It's available for free online. Uh, you don't have to pay for it. And I'll point you to the readings uh, that will set up every topic that we go through. In terms of the content, you all know that this course is asynchronous, meaning you can watch the videos and do the work on your own time. We do have office hours every week, every day of every week uh, between myself and the TA. So I encourage you to use those. We have 15 modules that will open, one every week. Modules open at, on Mondays. Those modules cover 20 different statistical topics. All assigned readings, online discussions, quizzes, those are really for the shorter assignments that you'll do. Uh, and so all of the assignments are always due on Wednesdays by 11.59 p.m. A large component of the course, too, is your labs, or your labs. Uh, and so we have 11 different labs. Many of them use R, not all of them, but you'll learn R as a part of taking this course, and most of the labs focus on using R. Um, and so one lab is approximately due every week, uh, and so you'll have that schedule uh, listed in the Canvas course site for when each of those labs are due, and so you'll have all that information available to you.